in this video, I'm going to quickly walk through the new check disk functionality and the fact that the process has now been broken into two parts. The first does the scan of the file system, which is normally the part that would take hours or days, but now it's actually online while it's performing that scan. And then the second part, which is actually going in and fixing the problems found during the scan. But that off, it does have to take it offline during that process, but it's only for a few seconds. So I'm going to quickly just look at the health of my volume. So you can see it's healthy. I'm going to introduce a problem. Now, right now it doesn't know there's any issue, but if I fire up, I can see there's a file on it, which is broken. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to run the check disk. Now I'm going to use the PowerShell version instead of actually check disk, but it's the same functionality. And I'm going to run the scan. So it's actually going to go, but keep an eye on it. This is still online. And it came back with problem. So now if I go and perform a get volume, I can now see a spot fix is needed. It found an issue on that disk. Now I'm actually going to go and repair the volume again, but this time with the spot fix parameter. Now keep an eye on it. We may see it, we may not, but it should go offline. It may be too fast to see. Yeah, so it, unfortunately it was too quick. Uh, on a, which is the point. Now if there were a lot of problems, you may not see it. But that actually just went and fixed the issue. So the file was gone. So it, it resolved it. Like I say, it would have actually, it did go offline and online very, very quickly. But that's the whole point. And that's going to scale no matter how big the volume is and how much data. So that initial scan could still take hours or days, but it's online during that process. And then once it's found the issues, then I just go and run the spot fix and it goes offline just for a couple of seconds to fix the issues and then we'll bring it back. And if you are using cluster shared volumes, it won't even go offline at all. CSV adds another level of indirection to pause the IO while it's running that spot fix. There's actually no um, downtime whatsoever.